Hello everyone, Meme here. Unfortunately, I have been abducted from my home and forced into slave labor and am currently mining sulfur in Uzbekistan. And for that reason, I unfortunately have to announce my official retirement from YouTube. Now, I know this news may be disappointing to all three of my adoring fans, but we must not dwell on the misery of it all, my friends. Don't cry because it's over. Smile because it happened. I'm pretty sure Obama said that, I don't really know. Of course, I would not want to leave my most diligent and loving supporters hanging, as that would be, as the great Shakespeare once said, I believe, not very swag. And so, before I go, I want to leave you guys with something to remember me by. Something that will solidify my legacy among the YouTube greats like Markiplier, PewDiePie, what a fucking and Deller. And so, ladies and gentlemen, I present to you, Remembering Me. Wait, wait, hold on, hold on, cut the footage, cut the footage! Uh, sorry folks, I've just received a breaking development from one of my aides that I've apparently reached 1,000 subscribers, which means that I'm also able to make money! <laughs> uh, let me just consult one of my most trusted confidants here, uh... Let me see here... Uh, uh, this stupid AI bullshit... Oh my god... Oh my god, it's real! Jumping Jiminy Christmas, I'm rich! I'll never have to work again! I'll never have to mine sulfur in Uzbekistan again! For that matter, what the hell am I still standing around talking for? Fuck Uzbekistan, fuck this website, and especially fuck all of you worthless, penniless losers watching me right now. You broke, but ugly batch of behemoth ball sized bastards. I hate every single one of you! Every single. Is it your case? Is it, is it? What? That's Jagger's always crazy weasel. No money. That's Jagger's Sasm. Not rich. Jagger's always crazy weasel. Limited. That's Jagger's Sasm. Demonetize! Oh my goodness! <laughs> hey, yeah. Fellas. You know I didn't mean any of that. It was all just, uh, uh, uh a bit. <laughs> yeah, uh, a bit. That's all. Now, if all of my wonderful money makers, I, I, I mean, subscribers, could just stop hovering over that unsubscribe button and just. No! All right, all right. Point taken. Well, how about this? I'll give you guys a top 10 clips compilation from the five or so years I've been on this platform, free of charge, mind you. And by the time that's all said and done, we'll have all forgotten about this little debacle because we are all so embarrassingly content brained that we can barely remember what we ate for breakfast this morning. How's that sound? Good, great, awesome. Well, here we go. <laughs> Call the family office. Hooligans! Gamer life hacks. If you don't want to get blisters on your hands while you're playing your video games, just lather them in hot glue. Gamer life hacks. 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 Don't you hate being bad at video games? Just hack them. Just fucking cheat. I'm just pumping out all the fun little gamer facts today. Gamer life hacks. Is that what it was? Editor meme, is that the bit that I came up with in that one video? Gamer, gamer life hacks. <laughs> Oh, 
Okay, the, the goal is to try to play the game like this. Can you guys tell where I am? This is the anti-attention spam. <laughs> like, this will make you appreciate like the Godfather more. Like this is anti-ADHD. This is ADHD therapy. <laughs> I I don't know Maybe. where I'm going. <laughs> this is actually torturous. Oh my God. I'm sorry, but this with you talk, I'm actually gonna be sick. This is, oh, there's an ad play. <laughs> oh, okay, we're back. Okay. I'm actually gonna be sick. Oh no, this is trippy. So we're covering all bases here, okay? If you like open world platform collectathons, you got SpongeBob. If you like those Temple Run mobile kind of games, you got Subway Surfers in the center, you know, just in case you get bored of watching whatever's left of SpongeBob. And then in the top right, if you guys crave a little bit more action, a little bit more violence, uh, we got Guilty Gear. I'm actually gonna be sick. This is, oh my God, this is unmanageable. I shouldn't have eaten that Taco Bell. <laughs> and then this with the Guilty Gear in the top right, it's too much. This is like the world's most unwatchable stream, I think. Oh wow, they just yeah. reached the ceiling, all right. Uh, <laughs> With one dude that coming out of it, really? <laughs> Sir, I'm the only one left on the forks. <laughs> <laughs> I'm the only one left on the forks. <laughs> and you want me to do what? <laughs> you want me, the last person on the forks, to breach the ceiling in the middle of four arms terrace, and you want me to tase them. Welcome to Meme Special Reading Corner. Oh no. You're gonna love this bit. I'm gonna love this bit. I'm, I'm looking good. forward to it. Alright. <laughs> you good? Today, we're gonna be resuming Catcher in the Rye. I do oh, no. Catcher Catch in the Rye. I always thought that book, I thought we said that book was about bread. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> Chapter 3. <laughs> If I'm on my way to the store to buy a magazine, even, and someone asks me where I'm going, am I able to say I'm going to the opera? It's terrible. I don't even keep my goddamn equipment in the gym. This bit's terrible. I'm not doing it anymore. I, I think I have a way to make this bit even better. Welcome back to the Way to upbeat corner. for a reading. That's more like it. Welcome back to Memes Reading Corner. As you all know, Last week, we finished off chapter three of Treacher in the Rye. And today, we're going to be continuing with chapter four. I didn't have anything special to do, so I went down to the can, and she the rag with him while he was shaving. We were the only. I we were the only <laughs> We are the only ones in the can. Just croaked. Because everybody was still. <laughs> he croaked. Sh okay, shut up, shut up. Strad letter kept whistling song of India while he shaved. This bit. So bad. <laughs> this is. There's a good chance I get my ass knocked out. Because I, I don't really remember how to play. Uh, check these pants. If those pants look like shit, what did you get them, bitch ass boy? <laughs> oh! <laughs> Try again, bitch ass boy. <laughs> we? <laughs> we, bitch ass boy, you suck, bitch ass boy. <laughs> oh, he's got it going now. Nice oh, get on oh. the ground, bitch ass boy. Get, take the seat to the head, bitch. Get back on the ground, bitch ass boy. Oh, no, we're not done yet, bitch ass boy. Get back down there. I'm gonna follow you to the ground, bitch ass boy. I'm gonna keep you down there. Boom, 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 bitch ass boy. Boom. Oh! Get on the ground, bitch ass boy. Ah, oh, you lucky, bitch ass boy. You lucky. Come here, bitch ass boy. Come here. You won't let the punch. You won't let the punch. Come here, bitch ass boy. If it's up to me, the bitch boy goes down in three. If he's not on the floor, then he goes down in four. Oh, I blocked low. Come here, bitch ass boy. Oh, this pain different. This is different pain. Get on the ground, bitch ass boy. No, we not done. <laughs> I hit it. I hit a uppercut too. Still in it. <laughs> oh, 
Get down on the ground! Boom! Boom! Tiger! Yes! I really like whenever you pause, he just does his like own little soliloquy. He's like, yes, yes, yes. We're we're going to we're going to be friends and we're going to we're going to travel across the land. Little do they know. <laughs> I'm plotting the most serious plan. Yes, we will go travel to the nine realms. Little do they know. Now say it fully. Hamburger. Okay. That's good enough. Little do Let's they go. know I'm perfectly literate. <laughs> now. Little do they know I'm about to lie about my entire backstory. He doesn't even know that I'm about to lie straight to his face. My youth started in the slums of Great Britain. London, specifically. I was a poor child. Grew up in poverty. <laughs> Actually grew up in extreme wealth. <laughs> now, there were troubles along the way. There were no troubles in forming the Legion of Doom. I made several nukes and dropped them on several major cities. What was I saying? <laughs> now, you two have an option. In this barren, medieval nuclear wasteland. You can join me! In the Legion of Good. Legion of Doom! Where are they? They're late. The zombies are late. The zombies are waiting. <laughs> the zombies are lazy. The zombies are slacking. <laughs> Benson. <laughs> Martin Scorsese, if he directed a zombie movie. The zombies are cinema. His hands are in the air. The zombies are peak. It's like every time a zombie does anything, the zombies are running. <laughs> The zombies are breaching and it's just like trying to get to the door. <laughs> the zombies are eating. It's just them, like eating some guy. The zombies are just beating the fuck out of each other. The zombies. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> They're just sitting there breathing. The zombies are breathing. <laughs> yeah, that'll work. It's like two guys. <laughs> the zombies are blinking. Yeah, that's close enough. We gotta fill the air time. <laughs> It's so dumb. <laughs> it's good, what do you mean? <laughs> it's like the narrator for like the fucking trailer. <laughs> <laughs> the zombies this summer. <laughs> the zombies in 3D. <laughs> <laughs> it's such a stupid the zombies on Blu-ray. <laughs> <laughs> and DVD. It's like the other guy <laughs> chiming in. <laughs> the zombies on Hulu. <laughs> <laughs> it's like somebody like uh, somebody who hates the movie the zombies are boring <laughs> it's like some guy on letterbox the zombies is stupid <laughs> you, you try to look up the music for the zombies movie like on youtube the zombies oh is he <laughs> <laughs> there's a zombies sequel the zombies are coming Two. The zombies are shitting. The zombies are pissing. The zombies are fucking. The zombies are coming. No, like for real this time. <laughs> like they're actually coming. They, they got they got caught using steroids. The zombies are juicing. The zombies are sleeping. The zombies are snoozing. Oh my god, the zombies <laughs> are burping. <laughs> yeah, cartoon ass burp. <laughs> the zombies, excuse you. <laughs> <laughs> the zombies, brr, excuse you. <laughs> it's like the other guy next. Oh wait, no, the zombies interrupt him. Hold on. <laughs> the zombies, brr, excuse you. <laughs> excuse you. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's like it's like all the middle of like the zombies attacking people. It's like the zombies and one of them gets their head blown up. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> the zombies, holy shit! <laughs> <laughs> it's like the main character dies. <laughs> <laughs> the zombies, <laughs> holy fuck! <laughs> <laughs> the zombies, oh shit! <laughs> <laughs> the zombies, we're fucked. <laughs> Wait a minute, aren't we zombies? <laughs> <laughs> no, we're Crazy Dave. <laughs> oh yeah, sorry about that. <laughs> Wait a minute, why is there two of us? <laughs> 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 
global warming PSA, the ice caps are melting. <laughs> <laughs> the, the guy, whenever he wakes up in the morning, the sun is rising. <laughs> I, can't, I can't say that on television. Yeah, you can say what? Well, like, whenever, <laughs> whenever, whenever he gets excited, my wiener is rising. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I got that. <laughs> Look at him. The zombies is stupid. The zombies is stupid. <laughs> <laughs> it's our stupid dumbass. <laughs> the zombies. Is he stupid? <laughs> it's just a Batman zombie. <laughs> is that a Batman zombie? <laughs> is, that <the> Duty? <laughs> is that a Batman zombie? I got a good bit for this. The zombies are stupid. <laughs> <laughs> I got a really good bit for this. You're gonna love this. The zombies. Is he acoustic? <laughs> So, what if I offered you twenty dollars? What if Ain't I? What shit, if, that's not right. <laughs> that's not right. <laughs> Fucking butter me up, I'll kill you. Now, I just wanted to add on here at the end of the video, there's no script here, this is no bit, this is all just off the cuff, off the handle, off the top of the dome, you know what I mean, sort of thoughts that I have for you guys as we have approached and surpassed such a monumental uh, milestone for me specifically. I know in the grand scheme of YouTube 1000, quite literally is something to scoff at when you have people like Jimmy Beast reaching over 300 million subscribers, which is such an unbelievably unfathomable number, but you know, to a small time kind of person like me who hasn't really seen much of the world, who hasn't really been anywhere outside of my home state, seeing a number like 1,000, knowing that there are 1,000 individual people somewhere on this earth watching my really shitty content, it is a, a very hard thing to wrap my head around, and I know that there's nothing I can really say to really adequately express how thankful and grateful and appreciative I really am of everyone that's come here and, you know, left a comment or a like or a subscribe, you know, it's something that I really can't put into words. It's something that you just have to feel to understand, you know, and that's why I just wanted to say sincerely from the bottom of my heart, no, you know, customer service, like, <laughs> YouTube rep bullshit, I really am, like, genuinely very thankful and appreciative of everything that you guys do, everything that you guys say, really anything you do, it, it works towards helping me and helping this channel grow into something that, you know, I would have never envisioned from when I first started this channel because, you know, when I first started this channel, I originally started it as just a sort of side hobby, just a little side gig to do after school. But after I got a few, you know, hit videos out there, a few bangers out there, I kind of came to this realization that maybe it didn't just have to be a hobby. I mean, I, I was never going to be able to make money off of it, but then it turned from a hobby into sort of a passion project. And so then I would take the time to record with my friends and, uh, you know, try to do this sort of uh, villain of the week type uh, format where it was a new thing every week. I tried to push myself creativity, uh, creativity, uh, cre 
kill me. Just kill me. Just kill me. Right through that clean shot. I want to die! But it pushed me to be better creatively and comedically and artistically. And uh, I know artistically is a bit of a stretch. I wouldn't really call any of my videos like high art. But, you know, that success would push me to explore new things. You know, it, it, it led to this villain of the week sort of format that I was talking about earlier with a new thing every week. And it would push me to be better, to do new things. Um, I would start creating characters. Of course, you know some of the more popular ones, like a uh, fucking Jesus Christ, which isn't even really my character. Why was that my first example? Shadow Wind is literally right there. I mean, I personally don't subscribe to the adage of you never work a day in your life if you do what you love. That's a load of horse shit, you know, because you still have to work to maintain it, to pursue it. And this is no different, but I will say that this is the most fun in a creative endeavor I've had ever. Because the number one thing that I've always wanted to do upon creating a channel is making people laugh, making people smile, giving people joy in their lives in really small ways. Um, maybe you had a bad day, maybe a stressful day at work or school or whatever, and you come by here and you watch one of these videos, and it's so obviously fucking stupid, it's such slop, but you can at least look at it and, you know, laugh at a joker and edit here or there and be like, hey, you know, that really helped me, you know, that gave me the push I needed to fucking, like, get my license renewed or some shit, you know? Like, I don't know. Something that will help you get along with your day. I don't know. And I'm probably gonna look back at this in five years, depending on if I'm still doing YouTube or not. Maybe I'll be fucking dead, who knows? But maybe I'll be looking back at this in five years and thinking, this this dumb idiot is so cringe. Like, talking about, talking about, oh, I'm gonna get my fucking license renewed because you watched Jesus Christ grinds for your sins. What is this fucking moron talking about? But I do genuinely hope that it makes you happy. Uh, as much as, at least as it makes me happy doing it. Um, because I'll tell you what, no matter, you know, the situation, like, if a video flops or whatever, I'm not gonna feel any type of way about it, because at the end of the day, I'm still gonna be doing what I love, for better or for worse. I know it's definitely not the smartest thing in terms of strategy, but, you know, I'm just gonna keep doing what I like to do, and if that includes, you know, a fucking Yakuza video, or like an amnesia video like I've been working on or something like that. I don't know. Whatever it may look like, I'm just gonna do what I wanna do. In the words of the NPC Spider-Man, I'ma do my own thing. What a crazy fucking video, right? I'm, I'm quoting the fucking NPC Spider-Man. I'm just... I'm a different breed, what do I say? <laughs> I mean... Genuinely, again, sorry for this stupid rant that has taken up oh, let me see here, nearly 10 minutes of time. Um... I just wanted to thank you all for stopping by, for, you know, checking out this video, for checking out all my videos in the past five years, even if they were really fucking bad. Any and all support is appreciated. I'm happy for you guys stopping by. Thank you for the likes, for the subscriptions, for the shares, for the comments. But with all that said, thank you guys for watching this one, and I'll see you in the next one.